So today I'm going to be talking about uh, Tucky Buzzard. And this band, Tucky Buzzard, is a British hard rock band who formed in England in 1969 with Jimmy Henderson on vocals, Terry Taylor on guitar, David Brown on bass, Paul Francis on drums, and Nick Graham on keyboards. Um, so the genres of music they play um, ranges from hard rock to progressive rock to psychedelic rock, um, garage garage rock, and um, and a little bit of kind of bluesy kind of blues rock as well mixed in with that, because some of the music you can have that little kind of bluesy feel to it, um, as well as a hard rock mixed with somewhat kind of a little bluesy rock as well. Um, which I really like really like about bands like this that they kind of switch switch up the music instead of just having all the music um, hard rock, they kind of switch it up, which I really enjoy bands that do that. Kind of change it up every now and then. Anyways, um, so, Tucky Buzzard's debut album, Coming On Again, it's a hard rock album, which was released on, released in 1971. Um, so, the songs on the album includes the 14 minute and 11 second song, Sweet Coming On Again, Part 1, for Marie's. Over the Hill, Coming On Again, Part 2, Believe Me, Here I Am, You're All Alone. Um, that does a two, oh, and that does, um, You're All Alone, um, then after that it's a two minute and 57 second song, You Will ne you never will. Um, so that first one had, like I said, four, all the very first song that I said was 14 minutes and 11 seconds long, um, which has Sweet Coming On Again, Part 1, for Maurice, Over the Hill, Coming On Again. And then it goes to Part 2, Believe Me, Here I Am. Um, yeah, you're all alone. Then the two minute and 57 second song, You Never Will, Free Ticket, and last is Lady Fair. Um, but yeah, I would say this, this, this album here starts off with a very, very long song. 14 minutes and 11 seconds, that's crazy. Um, starts off with a very long song. Um... Well, like I said, what a great, if you're into that hard rock, kind of hard rock um, music, um, this band here is definitely, definitely one to check out. So what I really like about this band here is um, they have the keyboards kind of mixed in with, you know, the, the uh, music that they're playing, hard rock. Um, so this band kind of some of the music kind of gives me the vibe of, um, if you ever heard the band Atomic Rooster, um, which I've done album reviews of that. Um, so Atomic Rooster is kind of, I found a little bit similar because the top, with Atomic Rooster you can hear the keyboards. And Atomic Rooster is this prog, prog rock, progressive rock, um, and hard rock. Because I found their kind of music was very similar to this band here um very very similar i found um compared to the other band um so they were around you know around uh, around the same time um atomic rooster formed in 69 um so it was around the same time that you know the same in the same I found their music was very, very similar, I found, quite similar. Um, but going back to this album here, um, 
I would say, you know, uh, this band here is great. I love, um, love that kind of music. Hard rock mixed in with some, like, kind of, some of their stuff, like I said, was this kind of, you can hear this psychedelic kind of rock, which I really, really love that. Um, I think they were still doing, bands were still doing that in the early 70s, this psychedelic psychedelic rock, even though I think it started in like the late 60s, you know, with bands like um, Iron Butterfly, um, the Rolling Stones were doing some, you know, psychedelic rock like in the late 60s, um, well, 67 with their, um, their Satanic Majesties re uh, Request, which I've done album use of the Stones, if you want to check that one out. Um, but um, going back to this album here, um, this, like I said, their debut album, um, and I have to say, their music, I, I, once I started listening to their music, I love that kind of, when it comes to stuff like that, hard rock, psychedelic rock, uh, for some reason, I love hard rock from the um, early, you know, from the 70s, for some reason, I, that kind of, that, um, Music from that year, from the 70s, rock, hard rock, rock, you know, you know, blues rock, whatever, but really great. So I'll go through the songs again. There's, so it starts off with the 14 minute and the 11 second song, Sweet, Coming On Again, Part 1. For Maurice, Over the Hill, Coming On Again, Part 2. Believe me, here I am. Um, so I can leave all that there. You know, very, very long all together. You know, like adds up to 14 minutes and 11 seconds. Uh, there's that. And you're all alone, believe us, with that. Um, you're all alone. And there's two minutes, and after that whole 14 minutes and 11 seconds song to start it off, which is, which is crazy, which is great. I love, you know, what a, you think, you know, to start off the album with a very, very long 14 minutes, that's crazy. After this, a two minute and 57 second song, You Never Will, free ticket, and last is Lady Fair. Um, so I'm going to do all their studio albums um they so they had about five five albums out all together um they quote you know five albums from like like i said from 19 1971 to like 73 uh within that two years but it was two years they released four out you know four albums which which they were busy in like 71, three albums in 71, two in 73, that's crazy. Anyways, make sure to hit that thumbs up, stay be stay tuned, um, next I'm going to be talking about their second studio album, so don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. Hope you really enjoyed it, and all you people that did subscribe, thank you very much. Check out my other channel on Doug's Guitar Works, which is basically, mostly about guitars, um, and that, and playing guitar. And um, check that channel out. Um, it's called Doug's Guitar Works. So that's my second channel. So um, if you don't mind, you can check that out. And thank you very much for watching. And uh, I'll be right back.